I'll be sharing a tip with you which has got nothing to do with music making, it's got nothing to do with your DAWs, uh, but instead I'll be sharing a tip with you to keep your desktop clean. Let's take a look. I'm sure most of you have desktops that uh, look like this. It looks extremely ugly, uh, it becomes very time consuming to find something from the stack and wade through a lot of files and folders. Um, for me, this is really embarrassing when I'm uh, when I'm presenting something to my client or a producer. I really want, uh, I, I really don't want him to see the mess on my desktop. So while I'm not going to teach you how to organize your files and folders and sort them, I'm definitely going to uh, show you a very simple and an easy trick to at least keep your desktop look neat and tidy. So here we go. Okay, we'll start by creating a new empty folder. I'm sure you know how to do that. This is the folder. I'm just going to label it my desk. Obviously, you're free to label it what you want to. For now, I'm going to tag it red so that it's easier for you to notice. The next step is to launch an application called Automator that comes pre installed in every Mac. You can find it in your applications folder or your launch pad. So, open Automator. Now, what is Automator? Automator is a strong scripting engine to customize workflows and services which are built within macOS. In this case, we are just going to uh, start with a standard empty workflow. So select workflow over here and say choose. You can see that there are a bunch of uh, categories on the left, a lot of them. And each of these categories have subcategories. For what we want to do, we want to uh, jump to the files and folders category. Within this category, we'll be using four tasks to uh, build our workflow uh, to clean our desktop. You begin by selecting Get Specified Finder Items. Click on that and drag it to the right. In that, click on the Add button and select Desktop. After that, the next task is uh, Get Folder Contents over here. Drag it below the first tab. The third is filter finder items. Again, drag it below the get folder contents tab. And finally, move finder items. Okay. Now, get specified finder items. It gets the desktop. It gets the contents of the desktop folder. Now we want to filter the finder items. So we're going to add a filter where all of the following are true name is not my desk you'll have to name this you'll have to fill up this field exactly uh, on the name of uh, the, the folder the new folder that you created because it's very important you do that and finally in the fourth tab you select move finder items to select other navigate to the new folder that you created my desk and choose that once again, get specified finder items, which is the desktop in our case, get the contents of the desktop, filter items and select those which are not named as my desk and move those selected items to that new folder. To check if you've done everything correctly, click on the run button over here and I think it's working perfectly. And uh, once you confirm that it's working perfectly, you can save it as an application, obviously, so that you don't have to do this all over again. It doesn't make sense if you have to do this every time you want to clean up your desktop, right? So file, save, in the drop-down menu, in the file format drop-down menu, select application rather than workflow. And you can save it within your applications folder and call it clean desk or whatever you want to name it and say save. Once you've done that, you can quit Automator, go to your applications folder and drag clean desk out to your dock and check if it's working the way it should. I'm just going to grab all of these files again and put them out on the desktop there the mess is back now I'll just go to the dock and click on the clean desk app 
and within a fraction of a second your desktop is clean. Please remember that for the script and for this workflow to work it's very imperative that you do not move, rename or delete this folder. And uh, I'm just going to finish off with one more final tip in which you can make your folder look like a hard disk. First let me get rid of the red tag. Now click on Macintosh HD and press command I or right click and say get info. Click on the icon over here, highlight it and press command C. The same thing, right click on my desk, say get info, highlight the icon and press command V, paste it. There. This looks much better. Remember, you have to do this only once and every time you have a lot of clutter, a lot of mess on your desktop and you want to tidy it up real quick, just go ahead and click on the Clean Desk app and you should be good to go. I hope you found this tip useful.